It's already one o'clock. My house is smoky from videos. Hey guys. Fixing the tablecloth because my children always mess it up. Come on, King, let's sit down. So anyways, right now is lunch time. I just decided to go ahead and make some them so make them some quesadillas. We had leftover rice and beans from dinner last week. And so now I'm going to heat up my lunch, which is leftovers from last night, and then I'm just gonna add that rice and beans to it. And I'm gonna get the boys some juice. And yeah, gonna eat lunch. I've been editing and then trying to handle some other stuff. So also while I'm eating, I've already made the thumbnail for today's video. So anyways, while I'm eating, I'm gonna go ahead and take care of some adulting stuff. But yeah, that's pretty much it, you guys. I'll see you guys later. We might go to the gym, might not, not sure. We'll see. So yeah, I'll let you guys tag along for the rest of the day. y'all before we got home so as you guys seen we did go to the gym let me know if you guys are tired of me vlogging at the gym because sometimes I work our our workouts change and sometimes they don't or let me know which day you prefer that I record because like for me my target spots like basically my whole body but my target spots are like my triceps my inner thighs and my abs like that's like like those are my goals right now so that's what I tend to record but if you guys have a different body part that you're wanting to work on and you want me to record those workouts let me know I had to stop recording the workout because my phone was dying one and two like I said I, like through with the workout I kind of started thinking like I bet they're tired of seeing these but we did biceps and triceps I did a little bit of abs and then we did a 15 minute um cardio run was it 15 minutes no it was eight it was like eight to ten minutes 
We did an eight to 10 minute run and that was that. Um, for the rest of the week, I may be just working out at home. It really depends on what time, excuse me. It really depends on what time Brian can, um, Brian and I can get to the gym tomorrow. If he has to work late, we will not be going to the gym because I have my BSF Bible study group tomorrow night and I plan on going. I've missed the last two weeks due to pain and then the week before that it snowed and my internet wasn't acting right and we were supposed to do it on Zoom, but my internet was set tripping for me, so yeah. But anyway, so it's the end of the workout. I think I recorded, the last thing I recorded were the preacher curls. And then we did what I call 90 degree bicep curls. So it's the one where you hold the weights up here and you curl them in. And on that one, we always, we do three sets. And each set, we either go up in weight or we go down in weight. So you either start heavy and drop down or start light and go heavy. Um, and then we did um, hammer curls, alternator, alternating hammer curls. And then we did like I said, the 8 to 10 minute um, run, and then we did the ropes. We did three sets of 30 seconds of that. I think Brian did 45 seconds. I did 30 seconds, and then I did toe touch it, toe touch crunches, and then I did leg lifts, and then I did the standing like, I did the standing oblique crunches with the weight, and then yeah, we got the boys and then we dipped up out of there. Both of us left our wallets at home. I'm making sloppy joes tonight, so yeah, not much to it. Brian's cooking the meat right now. I went to pick up some cheese. Well, cheese, I switched us to vegan cheese, you guys, and my stomach has felt so much better whenever I eat cheesy things now. And the crazy thing is, you guys, that vegan cheese melts. So, sister, if you're watching this, try that cheese for your baby. Because I know he's dairy sensitive. But the vegan cheese is really good and it even melts. I know for sure the chow cheese melts. If you want to try, like, making him quesadillas or something, sister. But, yeah, so... If you guys didn't know, my sister has a YouTube channel. She, share, she shares lots and lots of mom stuff. So, and it's, it's homeschool based, but she shares a lot of like lifestyle mom stuff. So if you like recipes and stuff, check out her channel. I'd rarely do shout outs. My little sister, Destiny, is going to start vlogging again soon and things like that. But she has been sick with the pandemic. So she's just been trying to get her thing, her household in order. And I don't blame her for that. But yeah, check, check both their channels out. If you go to my main page and you go to channels, their channels are listed there. I'm also going to be adding Raquel's channel to that, um, Rare Beauty Envy and Leela's channel. I'll be adding all of their channels to my channel page just because those are people that I truly watch and I truly enjoy watching. And if you enjoy my channel, you'll enjoy watching in theirs as well. So yeah, check them out. I just got home, so I'm about to go in here, wrap up dinner, and I'll show you guys the vegan cheese once I get inside. One of them I've tried for sure, and one of them I love. And the other ones will be our first time trying, so stay tuned. This is the cheese that I've already been trying, the chow cheese, which I know melts. But then Walmart had this follow your heart, follow your heart American style slices. Like I said, they're dairy free. So it's a That's cheese nice. alternative. And I ended up going to Walmart because I knew we needed cheese for the sloppy joes. And I didn't know if United was going to have this cheese, but I knew Walmart did. And then I found these um, plant-based go veggie cheeses, dairy, glu dairy free, gluten free, non-GMO. So, and this is actually the cheese that I buy like real cheese, the Mexican style. So, yeah, try these out, you guys. Like I said, my stomach feels way better now that I'm cutting out even more dairy. So, if you have stomach problems, you may want to try that. And Brian even noticed um, last time I bought him some yogurt, I switched it to a coconut milk yogurt instead of um, a Greek yogurt. And he said, like, it, it sat... It settled on his stomach so much easier than just making it feel weighed down and just uncomfortable. So if you have stomach problems, I would definitely try cutting out dairy and gluten. So far I've cut out dairy and it's helped a lot. So try that you guys, but yeah. So this is my boo cooked the meat for me. 
And now I'm just about to add this manwich to it. And you cook both things of meat, right? Yeah. Okay, so yeah, this is two pounds of meat. So I bought the big can of manwich. And then Ethan asked for nacho style. So I'm just going to put his meat over his chips. And then we have a few rolls over there that Brian and I will use. But for the boys, I'm probably just going to put their meat on the chips. So that way I know that they'll eat and we don't have to fight with them. So yeah, I'm going to call it a night here, you guys. Um, Brian did the, started doing the dishes for me. He's such a sweetheart. So if y'all ever watch my vlogs and you're like, dang, you do all the cleaning. I do not. I do not always do all the cleaning. My boo will step up. Home huh, boo. Mm -hmm. He does while he acting. He usually handles the trash and anything else that I ask him to do if I'm just too tired. So, yeah, we're calling it a night, you guys. I do not in the house. Brian Defoe. Yes, you do. <laughs> no, I really. Maybe we should do. Maybe that's what we should do. We talk about marriage all the time, but we should do a gender roles video. A what? Gender roles. I thought you said a ginger. No. <laughs> you thought I was talking about these red <laughs> No, a gender. <laughs> a gender roles video. Like why I do everything that I do in the house and why I try to make it peaceful whenever he gets home. But yeah, so. Oh, I love you, Tonka Monka Bunka Boy. He's so sweet. You know, my boys like to act like mama boys on the camera, y'all. But look at him. See how quick he flipped the script on me? Look, now he sees the camera on him coming to act. Coming to act. Putting on a show. Look at him. I love you, King. <laughs> look at I him. I love you, King. Can you say hi? Say hi. Say, mm -hmm. Do it. Say, I love you guys, but Jesus loves you more. If you haven't already, please go ahead and give me a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button. And I will see you guys in my next video. Mwah! Do it, baby. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> y'all, they love doing my outro with me. <laughs> But for real, good night, y'all. Good night. We about to eat. Good night. Good morning, guys. Yesterday was crazy, so that's why I didn't do much vlogging at all. I basically was Bible studying like all day, um, like literally all day. Aside from the, have any of you guys had to deal with Texas Health and Human Services lately? So it's like the Medicaid and food stamps people. I had to deal with them and oof. It was such a struggle, but um I dealt with that for four hours yesterday. Four hours. All because one girl. One girl wanted to tell me I needed a paper sign that I didn't need signed. All right, though, we're going to let her make it for today. But anyways, after... So, Brian told me... Yesterday, Brian told me he was going to take care of the house. Whenever I went to Bible study, that he was going to clean it. <laughs> so, I didn't have to worry about nothing. He cleaned up. To me... <sighs> Because of what my nighttime routine is, I expected trash to be taken out and dishes to be washed. Because he made it seem like, oh, he was just so busy cleaning up all night. What? And so I didn't really check the house when I got home last night because it appeared to be clean. <laughs> so why, when I walk in the house this morning, I'm like, man, why does the trash can still smell like King's diapers? Trash is still in there. I'm like, okay, I can take out the trash, no problem. Get to the kitchen to make Ethan's lunch because I didn't make his lunch last night because I forgot. So I get to the kitchen to make Ethan's lunch. Dishes are still in the sink. Cause y'all, he made it seem like he was just so flustered with his night because he cleaned. And so I wasn't trying to put no pressure on him, but I'm not, but now I'm like, what exactly were you flustered about? Because 
what I do, what I usually do, because he did vacuum my room because I asked him to. Wipe down the table, swept the floors. But you see, y'all have seen my nighttime cleaning routine. And I would have vacuumed last night because that's what needed to be done. So I don't know. I'm just confused, I guess, as to why he was being so dramatic about having to clean if everything wasn't cleaned. That's a man for you, I guess. So, anyways, I don't have to pack much on Ethan's lunch because for whatever reason he ain't been eating all of his lunch. So, if you guys have not tried this bread, try it. This is the Dave's Killer white bread done right. So, it's all whole grains. But, you guys, this is like the most moist healthy bread I've ever had. It's so good. It's already been a morning. Even though I actually got Ethan on time to school. I don't know. When I feel rushed, I feel frustrated. Like, nothing frustrating could be going on. But if I'm rushed, like, it puts me in a mood. And I was rushing myself. It's not like anybody was rushing me. <laughs> but Brian asked for burritos, but he said, like, a... He shot a shot when he asked for the burritos, so I was like, no. But I'm here getting him some burritos anyway. <laughs> yeah, because mostly I wanted one, and I stopped at, it'd be the littlest little, I don't want to call it a shack, but like the little incognito burrito places that be bomb. So like this place has been a favorite of mine for like ever. And then when Brian moved out here, I was like, yo, you got to try this burrito place. It's called Texas Burrito. I was like, yo, you got to try this burrito place. It's a little bitty family ho family owned hole in the wall. Like, they be getting busy. I'm like, I really love it. Like, they're a little bit expensive, but like, it's worth it. So I'm going to take him some burritos anyway, just so that way he can see, like, I love him more than he loved me. No, I'm just kidding, but because I do love him. I'm going to take him some burritos, and I seen that he didn't take any lunch out of the refrigerator today, so. But yeah, so anyways, I don't think, y'all, this week has been so flipping crazy like i was able to get a video up on monday they didn't get one up today and honestly you guys i don't think i'm gonna get one up to uh i didn't get one up yesterday which was tuesday and i don't think i'm gonna get one up today like i mean i could skip my jesus chats for this week but like if i'm gonna upload like I still want God to be the center of my channel. So, like, it's so hard, like, if I want to skip. Because I have my Thursday video and I have my Friday video, but I didn't have my Jesus chats for the week. So, that's honestly the only reason why I haven't uploaded. So, I don't know. Maybe I might just take the time to sit down and at least edit the Jesus chats. Like, no makeup or anything like that. And just get it done and up. It's the inserting of the screens of scripture is what gets me. So, yeah, but, yeah, I'm here getting the burritos, you guys. Like I said, it's like a little bitty hole in the wall, which is crazy. Like, but they're, they're so good. But, yeah, I got some grocery shopping to do today. I want to try to work today. Like I said, I need to film and edit and all that good stuff. But I want to start working at 11. And since I'm stopping to get Brian a burrito... I won't get to the grocery store until about 8.30 or 9. Be at the grocery store for an hour. Won't get home till about 9.30 or 10. Won't have the groceries put up till about 10.15, 10.30. Like, or 10, till about 10.30, 10.45. And I won't have time to film if I want to start working today. So, yeah. And Ethan and I have a dentist appointment today, so... It's very, very frustrating, y'all. It's, it, it's just so much, like, uh, people think you're a stay-at-home mom and, like, your day is easy because you're a stay-at-home mom, like, maybe for bum moms, but I'm not a bum mom and a wife, like, I take care of the household, I make the home, I keep it clean, I make the meals, like, like, Brian provides the house and Brian provide, provides the food, but I make the home and I make the meals and I train up the kids and things like that. Like, my kids don't just go around running around the house all day. Like, no, I'm training them as we go throughout the day. Like, okay, like, let, let's, let's sing some ABCs. Let's, let's, let's do the number song. Like, let's, 
let's see what the Bible says about such and such. Like, that's how my days go. And I don't record it all because it's always in the moment. And I like to be in the moment a lot. So, yeah. But Bryson's back here. Why did you take your seatbelt off? Put it on now. Bryson be trying me with this seatbelt. I'm about to, like, super glue the seatbelt and he can't get out of it. Yeah, I'll talk to you guys later. Um, he's really getting upset because I stopped his music. But yeah, I'm about to drink my protein shake because I'm starving. So now I'll see you guys in a bit when I get home from the grocery store. <gasps> I can film a grocery haul because I ain't done a grocery haul in a while. I'll film a grocery haul, y'all. All right, y'all. So I just stocked the house. Just finished putting up the groceries. Yeah, our little fridge was looking... <laughs> Our house was looking so sad. Um, I did all of this with 230 bucks. Like, restocked the whole house. So if you want to know how I do it, let me know. I can do a video on it. My little house is getting sad, y'all. Not even playing. Okay, I'm about to start working now. Hmm. So I can get the boys something to snack on. So I'll see you guys later. All right, you guys. So while iMovie is loading up, I wanted to go ahead and end today's session of the vlog and say goodnight. I finally was able to film a video and it's going up tomorrow and it is my Jesus Chats Over Rest. And I don't think that it's what you guys were expecting me to say. So, But I mean, it wasn't, ex it was, it wasn't even what I was expecting to find from God. So, um... Yeah, like I said, you guys, I'm going to sleep. Uh, going to sleep. I'm going to import this footage. I just wanted to say goodnight, and then I'm going to shower, and then I'm going to lay down. My back is killing me. So, I love you guys. Good night. I will see you guys tomorrow, maybe. Who knows? I don't know. See y'all later. Hey, guys. So, I haven't vlogged all day today. I got up. I actually got up pretty early, fixed the bed before I took Brian to work. Took Brian to work, came back home, called, did a little bit of importing of footage, and then did my reading right, the word worked out, and then I had to get Ethan up and get ready to take Ethan to school, and then I called my cousin Jasmine over here, because today was the first day in a while that the boys didn't wake up in time to go with me to drop Ethan off, and Brian wanted breakfast burritos. And so I was like, yo, like, come over and then I'm going to get you a breakfast burrito and then I'm going to get you and me a drink from Dunkin' Donuts because her favorite place to drink drinks from is Dunkin' Donuts. And plus Raquel gave me the hookup on a vanilla matcha latte, matcha vanilla latte iced. Super good. I might go get one tomorrow morning after I drop Ethan off at school. Um, but... I took a nap today guys like I was so tired and that's the whole reason I had reached out to Raquel and I was like hey what is that drink you keep talking about because I was so tired and I'm not a big coffee drinker and I think it's because I took these because these are actually allergy medicine and I'm going to take one again tonight but only because if my allergies get bad and I don't catch it before it catches me I will be put on my butt later on next week. So we're getting ahead of it. Anyways, I just got out the shower and I thought I would share at least my skincare with you guys today. Otherwise, it wasn't boogers. I just wiped off. It was the spray. So, yeah, it's just. I took a bomb nap anyways because I was so tired this morning and I was up for a while. I'm like, I was telling Raquel, like, I'm seeing blurry. I'm so sleepy. She's like, you're driving. And I'm like, girl, like, I'm home now. But I drank like half of that matcha. I just like was not doing it for me. So I was like, okay. So I was laying on the couch talking to my cousin Jasmine because she stayed here and did her class here. And I was like, oh my gosh, I'm so sleepy. And I started dozing off and I said, hey, Jasmine, like, do you mind if I take a nap because that's just what's about to happen and do you mind just making sure the boys don't get into anything and she was like yeah cool no problem y'all I when I say I passed out on the couch like 
it's rare that I take a nap on the couch. Rare that I take a nap on the couch. So I was tired and I slept for a good two, two, two and a half hours. And it was so good. Of course, the boys are like, hey guys, mom to clean something today. Let's go destroy it. Because I clean. Anyways, I cleaned the boys bathroom. Try not to smear it. I got this in my boxy, my Ipsy today. This is a mirrored retinol youthful renewal, youth renewal nighttime cream. So, um, oh, there it goes. Don't know how much I'm supposed to use, so I'll only grab that much. I got this in my Ipsy, so it's my first time trying it out. I was saying that I needed something a little more thick because now that it's getting colder and even more dry in West Texas, if you can believe, like my skin's starting to act up. Brian's eczema is starting to act up on his face. It's always acting up on his back, but it's starting to act up on his face. So I got that and I replenished this in my Ipsy, um, in my Ipsy, add-ons this month because it's only $18 uh, this was only this one one this 111 skin was only $18 on ipsy and usually okay I'm done trying to fix stuff I hate when everything starts falling out okay so usually this would cost over a hundred bucks yeah, we got it for $18 as an add-on so I was like okay let me get it I was gonna get it last month but we just we didn't have the funds for me to get it last month, so I was like, you know what? If they have it this month, we are picking it up. I love what this did for my skin, like, y'all. Mm. I pray it stays on Ipsy forever, cause. I only like got a hundred bucks to be spending on one little product. Now, don't get me wrong, it's a good product, but your girl ain't got that kind of cash yet. I'll get that one day, but right now, I ain't got that kind of cash. <laughs> so, sure did re-up on it while it was cheap because I love the way this transformed my skin. And then we go in. Oh, I don't know if I told y'all this. This is just a smooth and useful anti-wrinkle facial oil. So it's vitamin C with rose and vitamin E. So because it has the vitamin E and the rose, I also rub it into my brows and onto my lashes just to help those out a little bit and it's really been working. And then I've got this in my Ipsy either last month or a couple months ago, this Context Vitamin C All Day Eye Cream. It's not my Dr. Brandt one, but it gets the job done. And I have my Dr. Brandt one somewhere, I just don't know where. I have a backup of it. And then the last step is my Ulta Beauty, Ulta Beauty Joyful Jelly Overnight Lip Mask infused with macadamia oil. I love this, y'all. I only buy it when it's on the sale for six bucks. I'm not spending 12 bucks on this. Mm. But how thick it feels on your lips is just so refreshing. But yeah. That is it for my nighttime skincare. I'm really hoping that this doesn't break me out or do anything crazy to my skin. So yeah, you guys, I'm gonna go ahead and head to bed. Good night, I love you. Sorry I didn't vlog much, but I hope I caught you up enough. Brian's already asleep, so that's why I'm trying to be quiet. But yeah, Brian's already asleep. I need to put deodorant on and my actual bed clothes, so I'll see you guys in the morning. Good night. All right, you guys, I forgot to mention. Okay, I had to make sure I was recording. I forgot to mention this um, lash and brow serum from Mary Kay. I get it from my sister and 
if you've been watching me for a while and you're like dang her brows have really transformed it's this stuff right here like this is no joke i really need to replenish it but it's kind of expensive and you go ain't got that kind of cash like i said but should host another one k party so i can get it for free Who knows? All right, guys, for real, for real, that's it now. That is it. Good night, for real. I got lint on my lips. I hate that feeling. Good morning. Good morning, guys. So it's Friday. We just got back from taking Ethan to school, huh? What? what? I'm making waffles and grapes. Well, I'm not making the grapes. I'm putting the grapes on your plate. <laughs> but anyways, Bryson is asking to watch dinosaurs. I'm going to put dinosaurs on for them while they eat breakfast. So that way... Put dinosaurs on for them while they eat breakfast. That way I can get to work because... I recorded a lot yesterday, but there's still more that I need to record. So... I have to get them breakfast and then I'm gonna go edit today's video, edit tomorrow's, and then if I still if I have time before eleven, I'm gonna film. Come on internet, don't act dumb. Alright, well while this is loading. I can get their breakfast straight. Okay, so get my coffee. About to go ahead and go edit. The computer keeps logging out on me. <sighs> okay. Yeah. I'm gonna edit now. Question. Is this a cute outfit? Excuse them water drops. I just washed my hands. I don't know. I've been wanting to do this tucked, kind of tucked in shirt thing, but I feel like I'm doing it wrong. I don't know. Who knows? Anyways, I got my vlog saving right now. It's 11 o'clock. It's time to start working. I'm about to get the boys' shoes and jackets on. I'm so tired of West Texas weather. Like, it needs to make up its mind. Is it going to be cold or is it going to be hot? Bryson, can you take your pillow and blanket to your room, please? The boys have been eating all morning, so they shouldn't be hungry until about 2 o'clock. And honestly, when we get in the car, they're probably going to fall asleep so they can eat whenever we get home from picking everybody up. But, yeah, I'm probably not going to go to the gym today. Actually, Brian wanted to run a mile today. Gonna have to go to the gym today, and then I'll probably record tonight. Do a late night, late night recording session, or tomorrow because tomorrow's Saturday, and I don't really have anything to do. And Brian will be at work. I can just make myself get up when he gets up and record early in the morning. So, yeah, I'm about to get these kids. They're watching Big Hero Six. We played for a little bit. And yeah, about to start working, so I'll see you guys later. All right, hey guys, so I had a pretty successful day working. Um, I had to do favor though, I couldn't Uber Eats was not booming, so I had to sign on to favor and do favor. I usually don't like to do favor because so Uber Eats, you automatically they automatically deposit your tip after an hour after the people have ordered, and the people have an hour up to an hour to alter your tip, or you just um, to, to either give you a tip or not to tip. So you just already know what you're going to make. And with favor, there's a bunch of reasons why I don't like to do favor. Okay, so first of all with favor, Hi. your base pay is $2. Hi. And they automatically make Hi. every customer tip $2. Hi. Now they'll have a suggested Hi. tip, Hi. but until the customer completes... Hi. Bryce and sit back but until the customer completes that order like they go into the app and they say I've received my order or until they're like okay go ahead and process the payment you do not receive your tip till after they do that so sometimes you could only make four dollars off of an order and you could literally so for instance it could be a 15 minute drive and you could only make four dollars off of that order if they don't tip so I don't like to do so I will not do favor Monday through Thursday. I will, however, do Friday. I'll, I will, however, do favor on Friday through Sunday 
because you get an automatic six to seven dollar tips depending on the time but you won't see it till the next day and then like the different like the difference between like let's say they do the tip me the two dollars well i won't see that four dollars or that six i won't i won't see that six dollars until monday if that makes sense so like i'll get my four dollars like tomorrow morning if they don't complete the order sometime tonight it automatically goes through in the morning but like with uber like all i gotta do is wait an, af an hour till after i sign out and i'll have all my tips and i can put deposit it directly now with favor i'll have to wait till tomorrow morning to deposit my money and then on top of that that extra money that i made on all the orders won't get deposited until Monday so then I'll have to wait till Monday to deposit that part of the money so since I did favor I'm probably not going to deposit any money into the bank until Monday King what are you screaming for so yeah now we're headed home Brian planned it off till 5 but he's getting a ride home I just finished washing the car Bryson so I just finished washing the car and cleaning it out I like to do that at least every two weeks or yeah, at least every two weeks, for sure twice a month. Sometimes I'll do every week if we have the funds or if the car is dirty enough, I'll do it every week. But usually the car is not too dirty to where I feel like we need to do it every week. But for whatever reason, this last week our car was, I don't know, maybe it is because we went two weeks without washing it. But this week the car was bonkers dirty. Or had it been three weeks? I can't remember when I last washed the car before today, but car needed it y'all it was looking a little busted and crusted i see you awake ethan <laughs> so yeah headed home get these boys in the house and settle down give them their tablets so they can go to their room and i'll see about recording we shall see i bought a new charger today because my chargers have been tripping tripping and tripping but yeah, we're headed home right now. And then we're going to wait for Brian to get home. I don't think we're going to go to the gym. Just because of time. I might let Brian go still. But I don't know. I was also thinking about working tonight on Uber. Because it should be busy tonight for Uber. But again, I don't know. Like, I don't know. And then Brian had all this extra food from his job. Because they bought them Steak Express. And he brought us home some food. So I don't think I have to cook dinner. Which would be nice. To not have to spend money or cook. So yeah. Yeah, you guys. I'll see y'all later. I'll actually try to remember to end this vlog for once because I have not been ending my vlog. I will try to remember to end it tonight, y'all. But yeah, I'll see you guys later. All right, you guys, I almost forgot to end this vlog. I have my flash on because I literally laid down for bed. But I, at about 5.30, I ended up working again. Stopped at 9.30. Got home at about 10. And yeah, then we ate and now we're in bed. And she's so, talking crazy and about to get beat up. <sighs> Anyways, don't be rolling your eyes. I love you guys. But always remember that Jesus loves you more. If you enjoyed this vlog, please go ahead and give me a thumbs up. Also, hit that subscribe button. And I will see you guys next week. Bye, guys. Mwah. Look if you buck. <laughs>